Good day YouTube. This is just another one of those super fun and quick videos to show you a bit of a RAM and CPU comparison between Windows 10 on the left hand side, so the current release, and Windows 11 on the right hand side also. Well actually just released, so the current release there now. Now starting off, uh, well, I know you guys are all busy, so we'll keep this quite uh, simple and quick. So we'll jump open to the task manager for each of these there. Now I'll mention a few things. There is nothing loaded in the background, uh, just so you guys are aware, just except for the save for the, the operating systems themselves. I have allocated three gigabytes of, uh, of memory uh, to each of these. And I wanted to show you how these uh, look because they are actually quite similar. So using about 1.6 gigabytes of RAM on boot up, this does fluctuate, sometimes 1.6, 1.8. And on the right hand side for Windows 11, also just the same, uh, 1.6, 1.8, that kind of thing there as well. So it seems like Windows 11, at least in terms of its optimization, is uh, good or at least the same as the previous iteration. Usually the, the next version of Windows is, is a bit more resource heavy, so uh, it's just nice to see on boot up. It's just a little bit nicer there. CPU, uh, mostly idling out for, for both of them there, so nothing really to, to write home about too much there. Uh, you could even say that uh, we're peeking out a, li a little bit there for the uh, Windows 10. But what I would say is much of a muchness, so that's really good to see. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one. Pure G son, pure G knowledge, hard huh? basketball don't need no college. <laughs>